Hey, what is going on, guys? It is Drew here today. We are going to be checking out Ruby Ice Queendom Episode 1 Red, White, Black, Yellow, which you know stands for the team name Ruby, Ruby, Weiss, Blake, and Yang. Um, so I was going to wait to check out this series once we finished the actual Ruby show, but I was doing some research and I saw this actually takes place in volume one and before volume two even starts. So it's kind of like a different perspective. So I was like, okay, I'm just going to go ahead and watch this now. That would be really cool. And, uh, one thing about this series is I'm not going to just be rushing it, getting it out the way, uh, because we do have the actual Ruby show to focus on. So that's going to be my main focus right now. I'm thinking we're going to drop Ruby ice queendom maybe once a week. Let me know how you guys feel about that. I was thinking every Saturday, some for y'all to look forward to on the weekend, a nice Ruby ice queendom episode, but hey, let me know what you guys think about that. That's just the way I'm, you know, <laughs> wanting to do things. Um, so yeah. I just, I think this is like a different perspective. I'm assuming since it says Ice Queendom, maybe it's from what more of Weiss perspective. That would be pretty cool. But also the style, I'm not going to lie, the style of this looks really cool. I love Ruby's actual style and how they do the mocap animations. That's awesome. But I was, I was literally thinking like, what would Ruby look like as an actual like anime style? And uh, yeah, this is it. So we're about to find out. And hey, if you're new to the channel and you don't know, I have a Patreon where you can get these early because I know some of you guys aren't going to want to wait a whole week, every single week to, to get these. So, you know, it'll be out on the Patreon early because I'm going to probably record all the episodes for this within September, then just have them stacked up, ready to come out every week until the end of the year. So yeah, Patreon is down below. It's pretty cheap. $5 if you guys want to check it out and get Ruby Ice Queen and Merle uncut and unedited along with the other ruby series so yes i think that's all i have to say if you're new like and subscribe i'm excited to get into this actually so without further ado let's go stories scattered and forgotten through time okay man born from dust oh was wait strong, wise and resourceful this is giving me flashback inevitable darkness creatures of destruction yeah, the, the creatures grim. of grim set their sights oh, on him wow. and all of his creations Man was hunted by the Grim. I remember and just this. When it seemed like man's brief existence might return to the void. I'm already having a Ruby Volume 1 nostalgia. Brought forth a great change. Man used his passion, resourcefulness, and ingenuity to uncover a new power. Ingenuity. Path, appropriately named Dust. Dust. Man thus lit their way through the darkness, and in the shadow's absence came civilization and life. Let's go. Woo! This looks good, man. Ruby Ice Queendom. Chapter 1. Red, White, Black, Yellow. Hey, Mom. It's been a while. Oh. oh guess what? Yang got accepted into Beacon Academy. How cool is that? She always said she wanted to be a huntress. And she did it. I just can't believe it. Dude, that's so cool. Honest, it is kind of annoying. <laughs> oh, of course I'm happy for my big sister, but I want to be a huntress too. I'm sorry for already pausing, but didn't we not get to see Ruby's mother's grave until volume 3 episode 1? Or yeah, okay. This is actually some I new insight, I think. Here's a signal. Oh, why can't I be more like her? Little do you know, Ruby. Uh, Little hey, do you know. Comes to weapons, I'm as good as anyone. Better Wait. even. I'm going to work hard so I can fight to protect the people from Grimm, just like you did, Mom. Yeah, I'm actually so excited to see the the animation with the oh. fights, man. Oh, Yang? Sheesh! Looking good. Hmm. Yang, you came. <laughs> <laughs> Ruby is as joyful as you ever. Mom, the good news, huh? I told her you got into Beacon. Why can't I go? <laughs> <laughs> oh, Ruby, don't worry. Your time will come. Isn't that right, Mom? <laughs> yep. Yeah, so the timeline's a little different here. We're starting off earlier than the show actually did. The arrangements you've requested have been made, Mishni. Your father is waiting. <laughs> oh god, I just realized we're gonna be back to old wife. Shall we get going, Klein? Yes. I like current wife. Oh, 
I had a feeling it would be from her. I guess I shouldn't be surprised. Damn. It's like that. But I was assuming it was going to be from her perspective. Presenting Weishni, our future huntress. Whitley, what are you doing here? I'm worried about you, of course. A test this dangerous isn't normal. We wouldn't want you getting hurt, would we? What is she about to do? No. This is hardly enough to be intimidating. Huh? So just shut up and watch. Damn. I've always watched you. My fearless, foolhardy sister. It's also interesting because we just got introduced to her brother in the show where I'm at right now, too. So maybe, oh, my steam open. What the heck? Um, so, yeah, it's kind of interesting, like, seeing this. I think I maybe I picked the perfect time to watch this because I actually know who he is. And, yeah. What is she about to do? Got me a little, a little nervous right now. It's her father. I'm ready to take my test, my dear father, sister. That's Winter. I hope you'll be true to your word. This is all utterly preposterous. <laughs> As I recall, this test was your idea, father. Weiss is prepared to do it. <laughs> I am. Now, please release the Grim. Very well. They if just... I decide it's impossible, you will fail. Wait, what? That will be the end of this foolishness. Oh. I'm going to fail. Is this her father, like, testing her to go to Beacon? They just have Grim? That's a little weird. Am I the only one who thinks that's weird? <laughs> okay, maybe it's not. Okay. Okay, never mind. I don't think that's a grim. <laughs> yeah, nope. <laughs> oh my lord, it did not look that big when it was pulling up. Pause. Ah, uh, ah! Uh. Wait! Oh, this is so cool! Oh my lord! Uh oh! This animation is too clean, bro. Thanks. Yes! This is everything I wanted. Winter does not look impressed. Okay. Is this canon? Because I would think Weiss Volume 1 was maybe not strong enough to do this. You know? Might be tripping. Uh -huh. Come to your senses yet. Call it off. Nah. Not Weiss is too stubborn. She's not done. She is stubborn one. Jeez. Oh, snap. And I'm going to somewhere back to, uh, wait, wait. Adam, are we really doing this alone? Whoa. Oh, you're just mindless drones. The humans fear the white thing too much to face us. Whoa. Are you? Do you think I scare easily? Hardly. I... Your bravery. I was not expecting this. Yo! That's the Schneed Dust Company's train. Just think about how much dust is on board. We might see exactly why, like, hey, Adam. <laughs> I mean, I know why, but like, I don't think we've seen this mission. This is a full messy. Don't have too much fun.
Damn. Damn. Yeah, we already know Adam's freaking powerful attack. Dang. 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 Does the light? Does the light work for them? Damn. This just looks really good, bro. Did Weiss lose? Your when? aura can only shield you from one or two direct attacks at most. Mm. When your aura is gone, another attack will finish you. That's not good. Those without power will return to dust. That is the law of this world. Okay. Oh, flash flashback. I was like, what? So she took one hit. She can take one more. She's bleeding, so I think maybe I already heard her, right? Pretty sure. Smart move. <laughs> On the sword is crazy. Dang! Are they in control of this thing? Dang! Wait, what? I did not know Weiss had the power to do that. Learning some new moves for sure. Okay, this angle's clean. Oh, oh, she's going for the head, huh? No, straight through him. Wow, not bad. Mishni, you passed. I knew you'd do it. I'm not gonna lie, her butler always been a W, bro. So, father, now that I've finished this foolish test, will you let me go to Beacon? You have to. Keep your word. Well, father. Keep your word. Have it your way. Hmm. Okay, so that was just a test for her to go to Beacon. Hmm. That's insane. Because we really, we really did not hear a thing about that, I don't think. Unless I'm just not remembering correctly but i don't think we heard about this in volume one so damn she went through all that just to go to beacon it really was her dream <laughs> robot damn no chance we can play the belladonna adam horse damn damn Damn. <laughs> Perfect. Perfect. Now we crash the train. But you said this was just a robbery. There are human engineers on board. Just humans. Not faunas like us. Ah. <sighs> Huh? Blake? Adam. Goodbye. Blake! Are you betraying the White Fang? Betraying me? I'm sorry. I have to find my own path. Interesting. What's that? A oh, White Fang patch? That is interesting for sure. Should we go after her? There's no need. Once she sees more of the world, she'll realize we're in the right. So he just, he, I'm not going to say he just, so he wanted to kill some humans and she was like, ah, eh, no, that's not right. I'm out of here. I'm assuming it was more of a buildup than that in, in reality. But yeah, I mean, I feel like Blake's just a good person, you know? Wait, wait. Wait. I forgot how big the city of Vale is. It's way more fun than Is this the uh, oh. They've got the best music. Oh, and the cafes and the weapons. I don't know how I'm going to This is like the original them. scene from episode 1, right? And I still have to get a gift for Yang too. Huh? This is so, it's so cool seeing this animated. In, in this style. Yeah, in the shop. Yo. <laughs> 
Club Weapons Magazine. Oh, this is the coolest. Patch doesn't have this yet. Bale really does have everything, huh? We, we are delighted to accept you into our school. Hmm. So you hey, ain't got in a beacon. Did Maria come home yet? Nope, not yet. It's sure. not like her to be gone for so long. Wow. Rumor has it she's secretly buying you a going away present, Yang. Dad, why would you tell me that? I've been trying yeah, to be dumb. <laughs> I like presents. Uh, it's going to be a lot harder to go out as a family after you're gone. I really hope Ruby will be okay without me around. She tends to get caught up in her own little world sometimes, you know. A little independence will do her good. I'm a little shocked right now. To support each other, but she can't rely on you for everything, you know. I know, I know. You're right, Dad. Cause like, like they're just showing a lot, instance. a lot more. So it's actually really cool. Oh, here we go, Torchwick. Do you have any idea how hard it is to find a dust shop open this late? <gasps> uh oh. You can take the money. I don't want your money. Ruby's about to be just jamming out, bro. The first stage of a weapons transformation should combine offensive and defensive strategies. Yeah, the first stage of a weapons transformation should combine offensive and defensive strategies. Yeah, totally. Huh. Hey kid, hands up. Huh? Yes? Uh. Can I help you? I said hands up. Oh. Are you robbing me? Oh, are you robbing me? Yes. <laughs> Yeah, and that was the moment. Oh, that that movement. Wow, assemblance. Is she a Beacon Academy student? Dang. Oh my God. This actually looks so cool. Oh, oh. Come on, yo. I've been waiting to see this in action right now. Oh wow! It's like frame by frame is elegantly animated. Oh my god! Oh yeah, these dudes are down for. Ah, uh. hey! Boom! What you gonna do, buddy? You really do get what you pay for. Well, little red, you grow into perfectly fine heist. I'd love to stay and play, but this is where we part ways. Nope. He thought it was done here. Don't let him get away. You won't get away. Yeah. I hated Torchwood's. He had so many getaway plans, dude. You sure are a persistent brat. Uh oh. She's close. Ruby, where wow, they were they were out for her. What happened here? It just happened so fast. What's going on? What in the world did you do this time? <laughs> That is not good. Isn't this when the uh, teachers came? Yeah. What? Oh. Oh, I totally thought that was Weiss for a second. I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. They changed this stuff. No, okay. We got a huntress. Let's beat it. Wow. And this is Cinder's first appearance, too. Crazy getaway. Oh, hi. You're a real huntress. <laughs> Did you not stop to think about how your actions put others in harm's way? Damn. And on top of that, <laughs> was your aura even strong enough to stop all of the attacks? Maybe. Well, not. Uh, no. She tried her best, miss. Oh, sir. Professor Osman. 
Ospin! Stopping by for a quick visit. My boy. Good evening. You gone. Guy. Professor. Ospin. Yep. Master at Beacon Academy. Nice to meet you. Now, I have a question for you. Miss Rose, do you want to attend my school two years early? Huh? You're coming with me? I can't believe it! Yeah. <laughs> wow. Professor Ospin said he'd let me skip ahead to get in. Amazing! Now we get to oh. Beacon together! Yeah. She's gifted, Tai Yang. She reminds me of you and the rest of Team Stark. She's still just a child, though. All birds eventually leave the nest. Yeah, yeah, I know. I just never thought they'd leave together. <laughs> Honestly, I thought I thought uh, her dad would be a little sad, but he looked kind of fine. Blake, yeah. Wow, so this was all... Okay. I don't know if everything here is completely canon, but the fact that all this could have been happening at the same time is kind of crazy to me. Like, Blake just stopped being friends with Adam, uh, or just cut off Adam Doris as Ruby, not like, not like the exact same time, but like, you know, around each other. That is crazy to me, because I, I, I initially thought like Adam Taurus and uh, Blake stopped being friends a long time ago, and Blake left the white thing a long time ago, but it seemed like it was rather close to her joining Beacon. But, yeah. Notice of acceptance. Now I... Now I can take a different path. Well, Little did we know everything that would happen, man. Mishni. Thank you, Klein. I'd better go. Would you wait just a little bit longer? Looks like Winter was too busy to come. Dang. And of course, Father and Whitley couldn't be bothered to see me off. <laughs> but... It'd be like that. I'm really happy that you came to say goodbye to me, Klein. Thank you so much for Klein's everything. Klein's a W. Please do take care of yourself, Miss Schnee. I'm certain you will make a fine huntress. Remember who you are and carry on the legacy of Master Nicholas. I believe in you. Time for me to go. Dang. One last visit before she's off the beacon. <sighs> oh, are we gonna see you, John? They made it. Y'all know me. I love me. I love me, John, bro. <sighs> wow, they crossed paths without knowing it. Luggage. Okay, for you and Mom and Uncle Crow, I'll try my hardest. Not much time for friends, though. But I can't wait. I'll be as good as the best huntsman and huntress in You'll make ever. you'll make friends, I've Ruby. My whole life. <laughs> That's the spirit. You'll make friends. But remember, you don't have to overdo it to be the best. I'm your dad, and I'm proud of you just the way you are. Aww. You got it. We know. Aww. Dad. We should really get going. Okay. Write to me, yeah? Hmm. See course, you later. Of course. If, for those of you who are here for my first episode, I remember I thought Beacon was in the ship. They went on like a flying ship school. <laughs> I don't know if any of you were, remember that, but that was kind of funny. The most brilliant lights will eventually flicker and die. Pira! And when they are gone, darkness will return. So you may prepare your vomit boy. Oh my god, the flashback. There will be no victory 
in strength. Oh, man. But perhaps victory is in the simpler things that you've long forgotten. Things that require a smaller, more honest soul. Yeah. <laughs> Ruby. Ruby fits that description. Extra okay. Wow, guys. I am honestly a little bit flabbergasted because when I, like I said, I researched this a little bit. I, people said it was canon, but it wasn't at the same time. It was like, yeah, this, this stuff happened, but maybe not exactly how it happened. Something like that when I was researching it. So, yeah, but they've when I search this up, people literally were like, oh yeah, it's a recap of season one. And then it's like some other stuff um, after the first three episodes. So I thought we were getting straight recaps. No, this showed us a lot of extra stuff that happened. Like I didn't even initially know Ruby was going to get something for Yang's birthday. Maybe I just wasn't, I mean, I was definitely paying attention when I first watched the show, but I'm like, maybe I just didn't notice certain things. Um, like, yeah, I don't think they ever mentioned Weiss had to freaking fight a thing to get go to Beacon. Um, and yeah, I didn't know Blake could really just cut off Adam Torres and apply to Beacon, and boom, we're there. And then, of course, you know, honestly, <laughs> it's kind of funny because Yang kind of has the least interesting story, like, out of the four, I guess. Um, I'm not saying I don't like Yang, I love her as a character, but... Yeah, when I think about it, she does have the least interesting beginning right now. Um, oh, no, actually, that's not true, because I guess they just didn't mention her, her mother's story. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So her story still, they all have a pretty interesting story, but they just really didn't delve into it in Ice Queendom. Uh, but they kind of hit up the other three's uh, beginnings. But I guess that's because Yang's older, right? So, oh, no, wait, Ruby's just younger, I think. Uh, <laughs> now I'm re-asking myself questions I asked a long time ago. Y'all don't have to answer all those. Um, I'll just go back to the older comments and get a refresher. Uh, cause I think these are questions I already asked, but that was very, very interesting. I'm actually really excited to check this out. So yeah, now I've 100% decided I am going to watch all of this in September, but it's still going to drop weekly. So, Hey, like I said earlier, check out the Patreon if you guys want, because I think I'm, I'm actually really excited to check out the rest of this, honestly. Uh, so yeah. Um, I don't think I have anything else to say other than like and subscribe if you watch till the end of the video clearly you like my content a little bit you know so I'll see you guys next time bye bye